Hello, hello. Well, I decided to cook this steak. You tell me what kind of bone this is. I think it's a T-bone because it crosses here and it comes up here. This is from the, the Amish market. Um, it is organic and I decided to... Mm, oh my goodness. I decided to use their seasoned salt. That's all it is. The lady at the stand um, in one part of the Amish... Uh, market um she creates she sells seasoning and flowers and stuff like that and much to my surprise it took me a while to use this as a rub uh, and i was never into rubs like really putting heavy heavy powder all over stuff like covering it over and um it really does taste good quite frankly uh so here's what i'm gonna do so what i want to do is share with you that i'm pretty much cooking for the whole week and I uh, found some uh, some fish. Ooh, he's a <laughs> plantain. And I cooked it along with some kimchi and kimchi sauce that I had fermented. And uh, it's very, very tasty. So I'm just going to finish cooking the plantain so I could eat some of the meat tonight with this. And this is going to be my meal. I'm going to have this cold. I'm going to have it hot and make sandwiches out of it. It's very, very tasty from the kimchi because the kimchi had a lot of garlic, peppers and onions. And... As you see, I'm licking my fingers. Um, and so let me just show you. So I'm just going to show you how I cooked my fish in the brine, a little bit of brine of the kimchi. Uh, as you can see, there's a kimchi, see? And so I'm, I'm going to make something out of my kimchi because I have a lot of kimchi, but I have TMJ and it's hard for me to chew. So I'm actually mixing it into the food. Mm. It's got a lot of probiotic in it a lot of flavor as well and so i'm just going to finish cooking my plantains so i can have a little bit of the steak i'm probably going to save some of the steak uh for during the week as well and so i did a whole lot of cooking today and i'll have my hands pretty free during the week all i'll have to do is warm up the food so i hope you enjoy my video I give it a, give it a, a thumbs up and i'm just going to cover this for now and I just want to share with you once again my delicious, what I think is a T-bone steak. I'm not a, a expert when it comes to steaks. Uh, I'm, I'm not that much of a carnivore. But it tastes so good with the rub that I lick my fingers and I actually want more. And I'm not like that with steak. Uh, it's got to be really, really tender, really, really juicy. In fact, I'm going to cut it right before your eyes. And I just wanted to also um, share. Um, let me see if I could share it. Share my fish as well that it was cooked in the brine. Not a lot of brine of kimchi. It was mainly more so sesame seed oil, which is very, very good for fatty liver, is what I read. Uh, the most important thing for fatty liver, what I'm told, is knack. Uh, and avocados are very, very good for that. And I hope uh, to get a better uh, health report next time I get my, my blood test, which will be this week. I almost went today, but I forgot too fast, so I had to cancel. Thank you for watching, and have yourself a great day. Bye now.